doing some bit of dagging with a certain person. Oh look, somebody's flying to London and flying away from London. Hello, yeah. I mention you and you have to come down and say hello. So I'm doing some dagging. And as an explainer, dagging is basically shearing around the tail end and getting rid of all this wool. And when a yo has shitty bits around here. They're little lumps and they're perfect for a lamb to um, grasp onto when they're learning to suckle because the teats are right under here. You can see there is a teat and it could grab onto that and start suckling. So I would prefer that not to be there. So that's why I dag so the babies will go straight onto that teat and suckle. So that's what dagging is. And the dogs love the daggings. Isn't that right, Inca? You're looking for yummy little bits of shitty bits to eat. And there's Maya already has a piece as I dag. I wanted to show you a funny thing. This yo here, she's an older yo. So she's had me shearing her lots of times. But when I came to shear her tail, she started holding it up in the air for me. She was holding it out like this. I didn't trust her not moving it, but she was like holding it up in the air. It was so funny. <laughs> she was helping me. Anyway, I can't video and shear at the same time. But there, she's all lovely and clean and ready for when she has her lamb, it'll suckle easily. The other thing about dagging is, it's excellent for when she gets shorn next summer or this coming summer, spring, this dirty bit won't be there for me to have to take off because it'll be uh, already gone. Oh, look, I've got to shear that little bit there. I was so amused by her holding out the tail for me that I missed a bit. So I better take that off. Here the dogs are looking for leftover bits. You've already been done, haven't you? Little bit just chewing her cud. Woo -hoo! That's the last yo I just shore, shaking herself out. So I'm not doing the half breads because their wool is so short and they don't have long tails. So there won't be any lamb mistakes, one hopes. So there you can see my bottoms, my bare bottoms. Okay, move out of the way. There's all the bare bottoms. They kind of look foreshortened. Now, I'm gonna open this gate and you can go back in with the rest of the flock. Come on. No, you wait. Okay, now you can go. There we go. And look, the sun has come up further. Beautiful, sunny, clear day. Okay, so I have not done half yet, but I'm getting there. I'll do some more this afternoon, slowly but surely. Yo by yo, I'll get through them all. Actually, no, if I take out the two half breads, there's 21 in here and I think I've done 10. So yes, no, I've done half. Okay, that's not too bad. Much better than I thought, much better.